Redstone engines are the cheapest but least efficient engine available. They don't need to be cooled, the redstone fuel source is unlimited, and they won't explode under normal circumstances. There are four efficiency stages. The first one is blue, then it goes to green, then orange, and then finally yellow flashing red. Most engines will stay at the orange stage, and it'll take them about 10 real life minutes to get there. Whilst at the orange stage, the engine will produce 0.04 megajoules per tick. This means that it's going to take about 250 redstone engines to run a pump at full capacity, and that doesn't include the energy drop over a distance. This means they're only really effective in clusters of 100 or more. To make a sequence of redstone engines, place them down like this, remembering to leave them one space apart. Now, you're going to need a conductive pipe to move the energy away, so I'm using a gold conductive pipe here. Now, above each of the engines, you need to place a wooden conductive pipe to draw the energy from it. So that's what I'm doing here. Now, once you've done that, place the redstone torches down, and as you can see, the engines have started up automatically. From there, you can direct the energy to power quarries, pump liquids, and if you remove all of the conductive pipes, the redstone engine can be used to extract items from chests.